it's a very strong word because like I looked through the DMs again and like nothing I said was attacking you. I was just stating facts. Like here's the comments I'm seeing. It's hurtful. Like I apologized to you multiple times. And I was basically saying that like, I think you have an opportunity to be a leader and to not let people continue to like talk bad or hurt each other. Cause some people were going after each other in the comments and like, that's not cool. And it's not your fault. I was just saying like, I think you have an opportunity to be a leader and be the big person here and like shut it down, you know? Yeah. It's just that like, when you like, okay. So like, for example, like with that, like recent post that like you took kind of like your way, it was very like, it wasn't like about you, you know what I mean? And I think you just took things that, and now the whole like, Lexi squad is against me. And like, I understand, like, I totally understand like those comments were like very, very wrong. You know what I mean? Like the comments went overboard, but I feel like it just went too overboard to the point that it felt like you were singling me out when it was the comments. It wasn't me. Yeah, I was, try I was trying to say that too. I mean, it kind of sucked, like, in some of the comments when you were, like, she's 22 and, you know, you were clearly upset with me, which sucked. And, like, what really sucks is now I'm seeing all these comments, like, Lexi is effing 22. Like, it's like, you know, you feel Lexi fans are attacking you, which I need to shut down. Like, that's not okay. I don't respect anyone that attacks anyone on here. Um, but now, like, all these Ben people are attacking me. And it's like, everyone needs to stop attacking everyone. Like, we, like me and Amber were just having a mature conversation. And I never meant for that to hurt anyone. Like, I was hurt too, you know? Like, I felt like people were against me. I haven't felt this way since, like, high school. Um, yeah. But I think the bigger message here... Um, and like, I have nothing for, but love for you. And I, I feel genuinely horrible that you were crying and like, that should never happen. But now I think yes. the bigger issue here is that like all these other people are continuing to like attack each other. Like no one should ever attack you. Like frankly, yeah. I don't think people should be attacking me when they don't even know what happened. Um, yeah. so that sucks. And I feel like, yeah, I feel like, um, because I was talking to Ben and, like, um, I feel like, yeah, we should have, like, had, like, I think, like, a less of a text chat so we knew, like, how we were on levels. But then it's, like, yeah. I don't know if you know, like, the Ben, um, like, the fandoms as such. Like, they have, like, the little groups and then they come together so as fun. one, if that makes sense. So that's why there's, like, so many people. Yeah. And I, think I know everyone's like, like overall supporters in the same group. Yeah, sorry, continue. Yeah. And I just like the thing, like, I feel like so bad because, like, I didn't mean that, like, recent, recent, like, that recent post I had against you. It yeah. was meant much for, for, like, I've just been so over, like, the squad's, like, positioning, to be honest. Yeah. And, like, I've been here for like nearly three years and it's just very hard to like, like I looked up to you so much and like it just felt like it really hurt like when you have like someone talk to you like that and it's very hurtful and then like call me not a supporter which like in the comments about like the reason and it just kind of hurt a lot because it was just like, like I love Ben like so much and then the fact that like, you just said it, it was just very like hurtful. I mean, I definitely, I met anyone in the comments that wasn't, because a lot of people were just like, oh, the squad is canceled, the squad sucks, because after the Andrew thing, and it sucks, because, like, they lump us all in together sometimes, and it's like, I am extremely racist, I would never say anything, but then I got lumped into that, and then, you know, other people getting lumped into this. Um, it's just, it's just like, I don't know, it just sucks, because I'm seeing, like, so many of these people and like it's not you at all it's like all these other people and that's why i was hoping that like because you're very mature i was hoping that like when we talked it was like you would be able to shut it down all these people just attacking each other in the comments and it's like i don't understand why people have to like cuss at each other and be cruel to each other and like it just it sucks so much and i probably should have called you because i was like super calm and like I, I totally meant things to be, like, in a calm, like, nice, rational voice, but you probably took them as, like, clearly you took them as, like, 
not that way. The other way it can be at all. And that makes sense. Like, and then like, yeah. it's kind of hard to like respond. And I also feel like um, since like talking to Ben for a bit about like how the squad, I don't think you guys like the squad like gets that we see you guys as like more of like a, a group of like people together. Does that make sense? And not like yeah. singleized like like people. And I think that's yeah. what kind of happens like with the squad like being you know like pointed at. You know what I mean? Yeah, I know. It's it is kind of crazy because it's like it's easy for us to all become one because you know at the end of the day like Brent brought us all in. Ben brought me in. He was the one that was like, "Hey, I know this girl Lexi. I think she would be great." Um, and so we all kind of came together. Um, and also, it's kind of crazy because like I never thought anyone would ever be a fan of me or like want to watch my stuff. Like, it's like that's not that's happening. Weird. But now that it is happening, it's hard for me to understand that like people look up to me in a certain way. Um, but it, it's, it's been crazy, and I get that people kind of, you know, it's like, well, if one person stands for this, the whole squad probably stands for it, but, you know, we're all different, and, like, no one else in the group would ever, like, talk to someone about something, and, like, I thought, when I was talking to you, I was, like, being mature, because I was like, hey, like, why don't I, like, make her understand that, like, I'm not a bad person, and, like, I didn't mean to hurt anyone, you know, instead of just, like, ignoring the issue like a lot of people do. Um, yeah. I feel like at the end of the day, it's like things get misunderstood so easily, and I feel yeah. really bad about that. It's all good because, like, yeah, I can understand how it gets to the point where it's like that. Yeah, and yeah. like, no one like hates you, Lexi. Like, I think like the thing like since like I'm in this like little group with um like my states like like Instagram, TikTok, and things. I feel like there's like a lot of people who take things very like personally and everything. But I feel like if you just like like I'm not like saying you need to do this or anything but I feel like if you don't take things as like personally and as head on I feel like you'll be like so much better off like you won't have to waste all your energy because like I yeah. didn't mean like and I don't think like everyone sees you as such a good person like see and it wasn't like anything about you or your like personality or anything it was just about the fact that you just um like promoted that product which just it seemed like because you since you make so much like as again like with your squad like all the squad makes like like underage like content right it just didn't make sense at that time you know what i mean and it looked like from the squad side like, yeah. perspective and that's all but no one hates you lexi and i feel like if you just take on things like at a less of a personal level i feel like you're going to be so much better off and like you have so much potential as well thanks i definitely struggle with that like because like what i learned when i talked to you is that you weren't like coming at me like you were literally just sharing your opinion but then like other people in the comments like were getting kind of nasty and so it's like it just sucks because i definitely take things personally because like i'm an insanely emotional person and like I get, like, hurt easily, which, like, I probably shouldn't work in social media considering. <laughs> and, like, normally I just cry about it, but then it's, like, I worry that people are, like, thinking, like, I'm a bad person, and it's, like, I want to go fix it and, like, make them understand that I'm not a bad person and I wasn't coming from a bad spot, but it definitely, like, it gets out of hand sometimes. But I thought it is really good advice, and I agree. I just need to, like, and my mom keeps telling me that, too. It's, like, you need to stop, like... <laughs> taking things so personally like people aren't gonna like you like that's fine there's nothing wrong with that but but yeah yeah and you're such a sweet girl like there's like nothing wrong and I feel like just like if you see people they're just like wanting that attention you know what I mean yeah. and like just don't take it as personal and that's what I feel like that's what I felt like it felt like because it was like oh Lexi's taking this very like personally and then like you hadn't seen my like stories like days and days before which was like it's okay but like it was like it was very hard yeah and I started getting all those messages and people were like oh my gosh like Lexi people are attacking you right now I was like huh I was like I didn't see anything and then mm -hmm. I saw that one but it was like I know some people take it a lot more like serious and personal into a whole other level than like you and I do which like is hard but no I, I definitely agree um I forgot what I was going to say. I forgot. But yeah, I definitely, like, if anyone is that's, like, a Lexi person out here, 
we do not say mean stuff to people <laughs> ever <laughs> we do not hate on anyone no matter what their opinion is be the bigger person like be a good person like do not message Amber anything except nice things, you know, like you're entitled to your opinion too, but if it's a mean one, just keep it in your head. Like, I think that goes for everyone. Like if you have something, I don't know, it just goes back to like preschool. Like if you don't have something nice to say, like don't say it. I think there's like a lesson that we can all learn here. And it's like, whether you're a Ben fan, a Lexi fan, a different Lexi fan, a Pearson fan, a Brett fan, it's like, I know you want to protect, but like you gotta be kind to everyone. Yeah, so true. Yeah, so, and you know, no matter what, there's no teams here. Yeah, positivity all the way. Um, I just want to say a big apology to you again that you were hurt and that, you know, you were crying. That breaks, that absolutely breaks my heart. Um, and anyone that said something not, like, unkind to you, um, I am so sorry about that. But I hope, like, me coming on here and, you you know, talking to you, like, I hope that makes you feel better and just know that, like, I love you and I'm a fan of what you do. And, like, the fact that you've been with Ben for three years, that's crazy. I mean, Ben's my best friend in the group. Like, I support him. And, like, anyone who supports him is, like, a friend of mine. So, um, yeah. But I'm sorry. And I hope, like, we can be friends and, like, everything can be, like, good and love between us. Because I would really like that. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. And, like, I think that we've, like, came to a resolution, like, on here and talking. Yeah, definitely. I know. Text is hard, man. Like, (laughs) even with my boyfriend, I have to call him sometimes because I'm like, I don't think you're understanding what I'm saying through text. It's like, what? (laughs) But, yeah, and I'm sorry that, like, the comments got out of hand. Like, I should, like, just, I feel like I should have just turned them off or, like, delayed them. And I feel like it's just, yeah. No, I know. And it's like, it's not even you that commented it. So obviously I probably would have done the same thing, but. Yeah. And thank you so much. Of course. All love. I'm so sorry about today. And I just hope (laughs) you have an amazing day today. (laughs) Thank you. Is it daytime where you are or is it nighttime? It's nearly 8 a.m. So I'm going to school. Okay, so daytime. Yeah. (laughs) I'm going to start your day off on a good note. Have a good day. Um, Thank you so yeah. much. Of course, all time. love. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, I'll talk to you later. Sounds good. Sounds like a good idea. Thank you so much. Of course. Bye. Bye. Okay, wait. okay, there we go. Thank you so. If Lexi's still watching this, thank you so much. Like it actually, like I feel like we've come it out, fix it out, and yes. So no hate, positivity, um, but I hope everyone has a good day and I am going to get off because I've got to go to school, but yes, have a good day everyone. Um, and no one did anything wrong either, if you guys are like so confused, no one did anything wrong. Yeah, and oh my gosh, <laughs> I don't know what to do. Um, I think Lexi handled it very well, very well, have a good day, I love you so much, Joanne, Joanne, I love you so much, to wait for the fans to decrease, I'm also doing getting ready, but yeah, I'm good. Um, I don't think we need to talk about the drama. <laughs> We love you so much. Thank you so much. Have a good day. You're amazing. So the world. Please feel better. I feel okay. I feel like it just was like very. The texts were just off. You know what I mean. And the fact that we talked was it figured things out. But yeah, I'm gonna get off and. Go. No, I did not date Ben. Guys, I'm just a fan of Ben um, and have been for a while. <laughs> but yeah, um, so I think I should get off. But, oh dear, what is every? Oh my gosh. Yo, give us some time. That's true.
Guys, the thing that happened, um, facts, is that just a little complication went down with, like, promoting a product that I personally saw as, like, a weird thing to promote if you're creating kid content. But then a lot of people in the comments went really nasty and then it just went, went down the hole, you know, by a little Anyway, I'm gonna get off now, but I have a I hope you guys all have a good day and yeah, first day of school started off with an interesting start. Um but yeah. Hope everyone has a great day and yeah, good luck with everything. You know, 2020 is a bit of a disaster year, but what did you promote? Just like this like stomach thing. And the mouse. Hello, oh, I'm still passing that. Bye, Bella. Okay, I'm gonna get off now because I'm gonna be late for school. But you know, bye guys.